India has sustained rapid growth in terms of innovation and competition. Modern India has had a strong focus on science and technology. India's achievements in the field of IT and software are recognized all over the world as well. So it's time for us to have a quick look over the most interesting mega technological projects in India. But before we begin, please do subscribe to our channel for more interesting videos. The NAL Saras is the first Indian multipurpose civilian aircraft in the light transport aircraft category. It was begun in 1991 as a collaboration with Russia and on 29th May 2004, the first Saras completed its maiden flight at the HAL airport in Bangalore. Later, a revised version has arrived with 14 seats instead of 19 in 2018. The revised prototype first flew on 24th January 2018 from HAL Airport reaching 8,500 feet. Saras Mark II A 19-seater version of the airliner is being developed by NAL in collaboration with Council of Scientific and Industrial Research. It also has plans for 70-seater aircraft. The Indian Air Force has signed up with National Aerospace Laboratories Bangalore for the purchase of 15 Saras aircraft. And for this, 6,000 crore rupees were initially released this year. The initial order of 15 aircrafts by Indian Air Force may go up to 120 to 140 in coming years. The National Supercomputing Mission is a proposed plan by the Government of India to connect national academic and R&D institutions with a grid of more than 70 high-performance computing facilities at an estimated cost of Rs 4,500 crores for seven years. Currently, there are four supercomputers from India in the top 500 list of supercomputers in the world. The first supercomputer designed and built under National Supercomputing Mission was Param Shivai at Indian Institute of Technology, Varnash. It uses more than 1,20,000 compute cores to offer a peak computing power of 833 teraflops. In the next seven years, supercomputer performance is expected to touch exaflops level. This mission will bring India a step closer to be in the select league of few top nations like USA, China and Japan having a large supercomputing power and improve its presence in the world of supercomputers. Global Indian Navigation Constellation India has regional satellite positioning and navigation system of 8 satellites. Indian Regional Navigation Satellite System is an independent regional navigation satellite system designed to provide accurate position information service to users in India as well as the region extending up to 1500 km from its boundary. This system is expected to provide a position accuracy of better than 20 meters in the primary service area. The Indian government approved the project in May 2013 and its first satellite launch took place on 1st July 2013. In future, the system will have 24 satellites to cover the entire world. That would be our own true global position system. The total cost of the project was expected to be $205 million. But the necessity for two replacement satellites and PSLV XL launches has altered the original budget to $325 million. The Digital India Program It is a flagship program of the Government of India with a vision to transform India into a digitally empowered society. It was launched on 1st July 2015. From building broadband highways, public internet access program, easing mobile connectivity and mainly promoting e-governance, the Digital India Mission's main aim is to bridge the connectivity gap between the rural and urban areas. As a part of Digital India, Indian government plan to launch botnet cleaning centres. Basically, Digital India consists of three core components. The development of secure and stable digital infrastructure, delivering government services digitally and universal digital literacy. Some of the initiatives that have taken place through Digital India are DigiLocker, BharatNet, eSign, National Scholarships Portal, Swachh Bharat Mission App, eEducation, eHealth, Next Generation Network, Wi-Fi Hotspots and many more. Digital India is projected for Rs 1,13,000 crores. Indian Gravitational Wave Observatory It is an initiative to set up advanced experimental facilities with appropriate theoretical and computational support for a multi-institutional Indian national project in gravitational wave astronomy. It is located in Hingoli district of Maharashtra. 
The major purpose of Indigo is to set up the Laser Interferometer Gravitational Wave Observatory which would enhance the network of gravitational wave detectors worldwide. Since 2009, the Indigo Consortium has been involved in constructing the Indian Roadmap for Gravitational Wave Astronomy and a phased strategy towards Indian participation in realizing the crucial gravitational wave observatory in the Asia-Pacific region. The observatory will cost $177 million and is scheduled for completion in 2024. So that's all for today guys. Thank you so much for watching Fandesi. I hope you liked the video. If you did, don't forget to like, comment and share this video. For more such interesting videos, please do subscribe to our channel. Until we meet in the next video, have a great time.